Welcome to the USO Penitentiary. One of the great tag teams of all time. Jimmy and Jay have been on a run recently that has redefined the tag team division in WWE. Byron, what can we expect to see from these two teams here tonight? Michael, I fully expect to see these two teams put on an absolute clinic in tag team competition. That's how good these teams are. Here comes the commish! St. Mac. I wonder whose life and career Shane's here to make miserable tonight. Oh, don't start, Corey. Commissioner Hothead is out of his mind. Completely unlikable. You know, guys, I talked to some of the members of the Mean Street Posse. They don't want anything to do with Shane O'Mac anymore because he's such an egomaniac. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 479 pounds, Jay Uso and Jimmy Uso. The Usos. And their opponents. First, residing in Hollywood, California, weighing in at 221 pounds, he is one half of the SmackDown Tag Team Champions, The Miz. Hope you're ready. If the Miz has his way, this tag match is going to begin in awesome fashion. Float over. Oh. And it was DDT! Spiked him. Beautiful technique.
that'll hinder your modeling career. What a stomp. Good grief. This might be it. Oh, my. Tag is made. A little tandem offense on the horizon. Ooh, right to the face. There are so many ways Jey Uso can hurt an opponent, but the biggest threat to a superstar going up against Jey Uso is the aerial assault. Jey can destroy his adversaries from the air with ease. And here we go to elbow drop. Oh, flying forearm. That'll turn your lights out. Jey Uso is looking to inflict serious harm on his opponents. One of Uso's forms of attack that an opponent needs to be well scouted in is Uso's numerous air attacks. An opponent has to keep an eye on Jey Uso when he's on the ground. Once Jey takes to the air, anything can happen, and often does happen. A superstar has to do their homework against Jey Uso. Oh, no. The Usos had dreams of playing professional football. They were highly recruited out of high school and played side-by-side -side as linebackers at the University of West Alabama. And when it appeared that a life in the NFL wasn't going to happen, they sold office furniture for six years before training to become WWE superstars. And but Elbow finds its mark. Every WWE superstar has a unique path to stardom. I remember in the mid-2000s when their father, Rikishi, told me about Jimmy and Jay receiving college recruiting letters at home to play college football. I've seen footage of the Usos playing at the linebacker position in college, and they were tremendous on the defensive side of the football. In the end, Jay Uso covers. An easy kick out there. Nah, not yet. Too early. You gotta believe this one's over. You know what I respect most about Shane McMahon, guys? It's that he could very easily sit on the sidelines and reap the benefits of being Mr. McMahon's son. But instead, he chooses to prove his worth each and every time he steps into the ring. Oh, he turns it around. Avoids trouble there. Byron mentioned how Shane proves his worth by stepping yeah. into the ring, which is something I don't think a lot of executives would do, let alone go to the extreme that Shane does. Yeah, for some reason, I don't see many executives from publicly traded companies jumping through announce tables. But with Shane, that's really become commonplace. There have been times in sports entertainment when unlikely duos have... This is it. Single leg Boston Crab cinched in. Oh, it's over. And he releases the hold. I don't think he had it fully locked in. He's barking about something now. This is uncalled for. But I don't think anyone thought Cesaro and Sheamus would develop into a premier tag team. Over time, the superstars realized that they were better as allies than as enemies. And when they combined their incredible strength, the results were something that couldn't be ignored. It was really unbelievable to witness the evolution of Cesaro and Sheamus as a team. We saw them improve every week and conquer a variety of opponents. To see the Swiss Cyborg and Celtic Warrior go from unwilling partners to WWE. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. During the rivalry between the Hardy Boys and Cesaro, we quickly into the cover with the title on the line. New champion, new champion. Not the fall that hurts, it's the sudden stop at the end. Ooh! He goes down hard. Dan, he's not looking very good at this point, Cole. Harsh impact. The two out of three falls match saw the Hardy Boys go at it with Cesaro and Sheamus. Was oh, and he makes the tag. That was a game changer right there, Michael. DDT! Spiked him. Headbutt! Oh, boy, he is rolling. Oh, what a forearm. Going to be woozy after that impact. Oh, nasty impact. This superstar is dangerous both inside and outside the ring. If I had to pick the most shocking... And here's Jey Uso. 
into the quick cover. That's not going to do it. It's going to take more than that. He's docking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Incoming. Oh, and he connects. There's no reason to lose your footing on a move like that. Come up counter here. Corey, touching back on Miz's title win you brought up. Even I was surprised, and I was a bit of a Miz fan back then. He was a former reality TV star who unseated a third-generation multi-time champion in Randy Orton. Michael, saying you were a bit of a Miz fan is like saying you kinda like Elias' music. I hate to say it, but The Miz did wisely cash in his Money in the Bank contract and made history that night. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Woods, Big E, and Kofi Kingston are two-time tag team champions. But it was their second reign that put the New Day name in WWE history books forever. When this guy's on, look out. The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination looking to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Gold. When we talk about the New Day, the team won a fatal four-way match in their second tag team title reign at 2015's SummerSlam. I may think the power of positivity stinks like a bag of rotting garbage and that Woods, Kingston, and Big E are idiots, but I'll give the New Day this. They're one of the greatest tag teams ever. And what put them in that category was when their tag team championship reign lasted a record setting 483 days. One thing you can't take away from Shane, Jey Uso's Super Kick! Man! The Miz getting outclassed here tonight, guys. But now, can Jey Uso capitalize? He's got to. You guys brought up a great point about SmackDown being the land of opportunity. Thanks in part to Shane McMahon. And, you know, I'd say guys like Mojo Raleigh and even Jinder Mahal should be thanking Shane. No, no, no. Let's not get carried away. Anyone that has success around Shane McMahon tends to have that success in spite of Shane's presence. Oh, and he reverses it. Precarious position here. Beautiful technique. Larian takes him down in a major way, too. Big. In order to be a premier tag team, a superstar and their teammate must have that continuity where they're a well-oiled machine inside the ring. I'm talking about classic techniques like cutting the ring in half, isolating your opponent, relegating them to your corner, and making frequent tags so that the fresh man is always in the ring. That's how you keep your opponents off balance. Nailed it. This might be it. Oh, my. Ooh, what impact. Uh-oh, stomping away in the corner. No, you don't think. What on earth is... What are they trying to do? I think we know exactly what. Going to take a trip. Boom! <laughs> Targeting the back. Boom! Man, that should do it. But now, can Jey Uso capitalize? He's got to. He's going for it all. If every tag team in the back isn't watching this match right now, they're doing themselves a major disservice. You've got to believe this one's over. Jay should be able to cruise the victory here. Jimmy Uso's looking to end it here. Oh, somehow. How'd he do that? Comes up big with the reversal. Oh, to the arm. Terrible. Looks like Jimmy Uso is starting to sweat here. But he certainly comes into this championship match with a ton of momentum. It might be time for him to recharge that battery. All he has to do is get to his corner and make the tag. There's very little for him to be concerned about. Oof. This one is over. 
Shane McMahon got the worst end of that stick. Whoa, he lets him out. What a fool. He had him dead to rights. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Uh-oh. Watch out. Oh, my God. Right into the second turnbuckle. Like a lawn dart. Not now. Not now. Oh, no. Oh, that's a combination. Bam. That might have done it, Cole. Jimmy Uso is in a real bad spot. What is this superstar going to do now? Uh -oh. Taking Shane O'Mac putting his jujitsu training to work. Wow. Is there nothing Shane McMahon can't do? Got to applaud this game plan. Attack the neck. I like it. In comes the Miz. Boom, what impact. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Oh, double hand shot. Skull crushing finale. And that will likely end Jay's night. Impact. The Miz was able to get out of the way there. Oh, it's locked in. He's cheating, Rip. He's cheating. Stop being such a tattletale, Cole. And there's a kick at it, too. So resourceful. Not where he wants to be right now. Hey, he got himself into this mess. Well, he's got to get himself out of it now. Are you kidding me? Bringing it back into the ring. Jimmy Uso set the fly. You gotta believe this one's over. The Miz getting out. Jimmy Uso makes his presence very clear now. Yeah, he's got something special brewing here. There it is, the tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. No, there's the reversal. Beautiful technique. Flash. Shane absorbing a lot of punishment. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Three. They did it. Wow. What a match. That match deserves another look. Here we go. I could watch highlights of that one all night long. One of the great WWE matches I've ever been able to watch. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. Here are your winners and new SmackDown Tag Team and Jey Uso and Jimmy Uso. The Usos. Jey Uso puts the finishing touches on this one for the win. Anytime you can pick up a win inside a WWE ring, you have something to be extremely proud of. That'll do it for this tag team championship match. Thanks for watching.